Greetings, dear ones. Here's your daily channeled inspirational reading for Tuesday, January 6, 2015. A three-card spread was done. The number five of swords, king of cups, and knight of wands cards came up by Sarita. The Radiant Rider White tarot deck by Virginia Jess Poshkas was used for this reading. I dreamt last night, oh marvelous era, that there were honeybees in my heart, making honey out of old failures. A quote by Antonio Machado. It's already Tuesday for each one of you, as it seems early on that you will find this to be a robust day of some kind. What a day of action to get things done. That's what some of you may want to do, is to take action. First thing in the morning, you could be ready to tackle projects that have been looking at you for far too long in your opinion of it. Then be careful of the feeling you get in your gut to make the moves to complete things. Take the time you need if you don't feel that you're ready to take the plunge. Planning is also a huge part of process and progress in whatever one sets out to do. Instead, allow yourself to be one with what spirit is revealing to you so quietly within you, adamantly. Spirit would also like you to know that looking back so much may not have the best impact on your future, and not today anyway. Use the fuel today to get moving, even if it's just on paper. You already know that what you focus on with the most energy and passion will come about in one way or another. Stay on what you want to see in your world. However, if you find There is a fire sign type of a Sagittarius, Aries, or Leo-born person in your midst who are attempting to control what you do, then soon it's showing up that you could just decide to put this person or these people directly into their place if they keep at you with all the shenanigans. Also, There could be a watery natured person of authority who has something important to speak with you about which will improve or enrich your life in some kind of way. The biggest lesson from today will be that looking forward is going to briskly slide you into the future which you really want to live. And although this is just one day, it does matter just how much and how you go about spending your time then even though it may get a little rough sometimes you can still make a go onto the new path because bumpy roads happen to the best of them so you may find your way to reaching where you want to go by simply being focused while also grounding yourself in your present get yourself a piece of ruby A rough piece will do just fine. This gemstone will lift your energy immediately for strength and endurance on your path. Next, be mindful of what you say to others as not to be intentionally cutting to the other. Moving too fast could also bring about disorder and the possibility of losing interest in your goals very fast if care is not taken. However, As intuitive as you are, your expanding talents are there in you to use with gusto. Those abilities could be showing up right now. So with the start at hand for you, a really wonderful new start, be sure to make the most of your current position in relationship, career, or work to allow whatever lessons needed to emerge from the universe to be gathered by you continuously for ultimate steady calculated success. It's so cool for you. So dive right in next. Also read over the weekly angel reading for this week if you've missed it. And go back to the website to sign up for our creative newsletter with updates just for you. Mwah, have fun. We appreciate you. If you need more clarity, go back to read this week's daily, weekend, and weekday readings. We guarantee you'll find what you seek. For now, remember your peace. We look forward to your comments, tags, likes, and sharing as always. I love your support. Thank you so much.
for following as well and for subscribing to the newsletter. I see that you all are doing that and also leaving comments and everything else that you're doing. Just tuning in. Thank you. It really is appreciated. At least I know somebody is listening to this. This is so cool. And we care for you so very much. Sayofia Sarita Spiritual Guide for You Is All Love. Take care. And if you'd like a one-on-one reading with me, please check out my website so you can book a time with me at naturallyhighlife.com. Stay tuned for comments on Instagram and also on Naturally High Life. Plenty of updates coming for you. I'm going to be working on some tomorrow as well. And I'd love to hear from you. For now, I'm going to go. I have some readings that I need to do for people. Peace and enjoy the rest of your day of Tuesday. Enjoy all of it and have fun.